Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with a Dog. こんにちは。今日はチーズ好きにはたまらない大人気のスフレチーズケーキを作ります。First, coat the side of the cake pan with a generous amount of butter. Using a pan with a removable bottom will help to remove the cheesecake. Place a piece of parchment paper cut to fit into the bottom of the pan. Then cover the outside of the pan with a large piece of aluminum foil. Next, bring the cream cheese, sour cream, and butter to room temperature and combine them in a bowl with a balloon whisk. Add one egg yolk and mix thoroughly. Then add the other egg yolk and mix. Now sieve the cake flour into the bowl. Combine the mixture until there are no pockets of dry flour. Then add the milk a little at a time and mix thoroughly. Be sure to bring the egg yolks and milk to room temperature also. Next, add the vanilla extract and mix. Finally, sieve the mixture into a bowl. Now, let's make the meringue. Lightly beat the chilled egg whites with a hand mixer. Then, add the sugar in three steps. And beat the egg white for a total of one and a half to two minutes. Avoid overbeating, otherwise, it will be difficult to combine the meringue and the egg yolk mixture, leading to more mixing and eventually breaking the foam. Just before the meringue is ready, switch to a balloon whisk and check its consistency. Beat until the meringue reaches a firm peak stage and has a glossy texture. Now, add one third of the meringue to the egg yolk mixture. Mix thoroughly. At this stage, you don't need to worry about breaking the foam. Then, add another one third of the meringue. This time, gently mix and avoid breaking the foam. Finally, place all the egg yolk mixture into the bowl with the rest of the meringue. Like shown, lift the whisk from the bottom to gently combine the batter. Be sure not to break the foam. Mix until all of the white lumps of meringue have disappeared. Now, pour the batter into a pan and place it into a deep tray. The pan has a removable bottom, so be sure to cover it with relatively thick aluminum foil to avoid wetting the cheesecake. Slash the butter with a spatula to remove any air bubbles. Pour hot water into the tray about 2 cm deep. Place the cake pan into the preheated oven and bake at 160 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes. Then lower the temperature to 150 degrees Celsius and bake for additional 40 to 50 minutes. Pierce the cake with a bamboo stick. If the stick is clean, it is ready. 
remove and place the cake pan onto a cooling rack. Let it sit to cool and then chill the cake in the fridge for over two hours. Now remove the souffle cheesecake from the pan. Gently lift the bottom. Be careful not to damage the side of the cake. Run an icing spatula along the bottom. Remove the bottom of the pan and place the cheesecake onto a cutting board. Dampen the blade of a knife to help make a clean cut and cut a piece of cake. This fluffy and moist cheesecake using meringue is very popular in Japan. Cheese lovers should definitely try this recipe. Place the souffle cheesecake onto a plate. Finally, coat the top with the apricot jam diluted with rum. Mmm, looks so delicious. The refreshing aroma of lemon also goes great with the cheesecake. If you are interested, add lemon zest to the batter after straining with a mesh strainer. Alternatively, you can sprinkle icing sugar on top. If your aluminum foil is too thin, you should cover the cake pan with two or three layers making absolutely sure to avoid any leakage. Good luck in the kitchen! Good job.